good evening everybody as we are aware an unfortunate incident took place on 7th of march around 11 am when gitanjali devi aged 32 years she tried to commit suicide near platform number 5 of tenali railway station by coming in front of jan bhumi express but loco pilot applied emergency brake still she got injured on her head immediately she was transferred to gjh gjh kundur in 108 ambulance she was undergoing treatment till 11th morning 2 am where she succumbed to the injuries based upon the intimation railway police station tenali they registered the case under crime number 28 bar 24 under section 174 and natural death women railway si saraswati garu a case inquest complete chesaru investigate chesaru so in that investigation it came to light that mana geetanjali she participated in one of the programs on fourth where she received a land patta there she gave interview to few local media channels immediately it went viral on all the platforms after getting viral she was brutally trolled the language she was told in doesn't have any space in today's civilized world due to that she could not bear she could not cope up with it she was mentally very disturbed and took the extreme step not only her even her family members her husband her in-laws they were not able to face the world so this came to light in the investigation of railways based upon that investigation from railways vijayawada the case was transferred to the tenali one town police station during this case as per the input from the family members and the investigation and report of investigation officer of railways we would be registering the case here in the nali one town and sections would be altered to the 306 apc that is abetment to suicide what gitanjali went through is very disturbing she was forced to commit suicide just because she posted a video out of excitement as part of ap police and ap government we are committed to the safety of women not only in physical space but in cyber space also now these days cyber space is as vulnerable for women and children as it is in real physical world already we have got few digital footprints trolls and even the kind of language that is used i cannot put in front of media also that is the situation we have identified certain social media handles we are still going through it we would be tracing the people the original few handles seem like they are being operated from by the original owners of the pages few handles they are seem to be outright fake but we will not stop there we will identify the ip logs we will trace them and we will make sure that these perpetrators are brought to the book from as part of guntur police and ap police i request all women and other people also whenever they are going through cyber bullying or any harassment our doors are always welcome we will take necessary action we will make sure that cases are brought to the logical conclusion please don't take such extreme step think about your family gitanjali she survived by two daughters one aged 9 years one aged 7 years and it is very disturbing as a police officer to me also so we we will make sure that these perpetrators who ever is they are involved in this trolling they are brought to the book as investigation folds up and we get further clarity on involvement of the people i will be issuing detailed press note and press meets regarding the issue meeku ichina information ittu varaku jarigina investigation plus developments nenu cheptunanu we have few things but since it is a very sensitive case and we are still working on it my teams are uh, have we are deployed for that i cannot uh, reveal the details as further developments are there i will keep on updating uh, 
press uh, regarding it and i request uh, media family also me degra if you have any information about this case any developments about the case you feel free to share with us we are there for